At NRL, our mission is to bring people together to enrich their lives. The All-Stars Week is a shining example of the way Rugby League can positively impact a national agenda while providing real support to local communities. Just know that what you're involved in is something very special, it's something to be proud of, and it's something that we all should embrace because we are making a major difference to a lot of people. All Stars is reaching out and creating leaders. For our players, it's as much about giving to the community as it is about the honour of playing. You can see, tell by the turnout, um, you know, everywhere we go, um, yeah, our culture just loves it, so it's, just, it's a great feeling. It's a huge honour and a privilege. Importantly, it's a showcase of what Rugby League does every day across Australia to affect change. Making a difference is about inspiring, bringing joy, tackling important social issues, and most of all, improving lives. Rugby League school programs are designed by leading education professionals. NRL's One Community programs are without a doubt the most comprehensive in Australian sport. We're really proud of the fact that we're making a positive difference to people's lives. We're change champions, we're encouraging kids to really make a change in their lives around using our programs such as Rugby League Reads, Dream Believe Achieve, our newest one, Tackle Bullying, and of course our health program, Eat Well, Play Well, Stay Well. We've got such a focus on really getting out there and helping kids in particular. Rugby League partners with many charities to raise funds and awareness. We're really excited that we're actually about to start our fourth year with the NRL. We work with the NRL every year around the Women in League round and that lets us not only work with the national clubs but also community clubs right across the country. In the last three years we've raised just over $300,000 and we've then used that money to grow the level of McGrath Breast Care Nurse Service across the country. It's a very tangible outcome. Rugby League invests more than $4 million a year in programs to care for and develop our players. So the Education and Welfare Committee, our main vision is to make sure that when our players leave the game, they're better men for having been part of our game. And that is we want them to be wise decision makers, want them to be self-aware and self-confident, want them to be great teammates, want them to be vocationally aware, and also want to make sure that they're proud of the game that they've been involved in. NRL programs are recognised globally and our team has been commissioned to develop programs for other non-sport organisations. After the siren sounds on a player's career, help is provided in their post-career life through the unique support of the Men of League. The Men of League was started in 2002 and it was started to help people in the Rugby League family who had fallen hard times. Uh, that included players and coaches. And, uh, and we've done, uh, over the years, we've done uh, pretty good in the 12 years we've been running. When you can uh, know that you're helping one of your mates who, who has uh, fallen hard times and we know that, that what we're doing is making their life easier, it's uh, really uh, a great satisfaction for us. On the field, no sport compares to the entertainment, excitement and inspiration provided by NRL. Beyond the sideline, no sport is more committed to its community. We are here, on and off the field.